We, we don't have to fight as enemies. The followers of the Honorable Elijah Muhammad are here to demonstrate our love for our people, our concern for the worsening condition of America and its people. Whether the people of America feel the need to reciprocate or not, I'm here to present a torchlight that is intended to save our lives as well as all of America if she will only take heed. So, my brothers and sisters, 
negative frame of mind. We've benefited much from being here. Even though we were slaves, we are the best educated black people anywhere to be found on the earth. But now we have to use that education. You know why Chief Malik of the L. Rubens is in jail? Not because he's a dope slinger, it's because he knew the art of organizing young black people. Hmm. You know why Bob Stale is dead? Because he had the art of organizing young black people. You know why Geronimo Pratt had to leave America and died in Africa? Because Geronimo had military science. And he wanted to share that with young black people. And they put him in prison. What they don't want is an organized black community. And they do not want leaders that organize young black men. I received a letter from Chief Malik. And I want Chief Malik to know that we are honored to receive your letter, brother. Thank you for your concern for the black community. I know that you're not going to spend your life behind bars because there's too much work for strong black men to do. And so we're on the precipice of something new and better. So don't, don't become frustrated. We will have what we desire. Either they'll help us to get it, or God himself will give it to us on our own merit. So I thank all of you for spending the time with us today. I thank all of you for your patience with us today. And may Allah bless you, guide you, protect you and me and us. Now I want to ask you, are you in agreement with what we must do to end our poverty and want by accepting a program to put our nickels, dimes, and dollars together and make them work for us as a people? How many of you are in agreement? Would you just raise your hands? Then we'll start. We're going to market this idea throughout America. I'm turning the ministers loose. But we're going to train you how to represent. Come on, boy. Sometimes you got to slap these dead things upside the head. <laughs> This is our destiny. So you be on the lookout for how we're going to do it. And let's spread the word. All you tweet people. My Twitter family. I hope you took notes and you were tweeting while I was talking. Were you tweeting? Yes, sir. Get up on Facebook with intelligent conversation. Yes, sir. Did you hear what the minister said today? Yes, sir. And let's create the dialogue. May Allah bless you all. Dinner is served at the salon. All my guests. And at the National Center. But all my guests, your dinner is paid for. You up here. So get to the salon right away. We're going to eat till we fall asleep over our plates. Thank you for listening. I turn you back into the